Hello and welcome back to OAP Gaming. In the last episode, if you remember, we did Rago's quest and we did the second of Violet's quest. And we needed four fly husks. But we only got the three. So when I wasn't recording, I went back into Gaslin Caves and I got the extra one which we needed. As you can see there, we now have the four fly husks, what we needed. So in today's episode, what we are going to be doing is we're going to be collecting some more components. We're going to be doing some more um, kill tasks. And the first of it is, we need to go into the heroic ramparts and we need superior cotton. Now there are two places you can get the superior cotton from. The first one is right here at the entrance in this big point here. So this is the one I use. And hopefully it will give us it the first time. So we need three superior cotton. Mm -hmm. And there we have it. We wanted three, we've got eight. Okay, later. Now, if you wanted to, and I don't see why you would, but if you wanted to, you could run through here. I will show you the other place. Sometimes there's a shiny over there. But if you wanted to, you could get some superior cotton here, at this dig point Come here. On out. Okay, later. Hmm? All right. Awesome. And there you go. I just wanted to show you that. Like I said, why you'd use this one, you've got further to run. But there, there's the two spots you can get superior cotton from. So now we need to take on six Yana Maguses. These are a guild task, and that's these here. These are the guild tasks. Let's do this! Come on, let's kick some A! Check this out! <laughs> Come on, let's bust some heads. I hope I've grown stronger than before. We need those. So I'm sorry you can't have it. And we also need the Beastman Rawhide. The Beastman Rawhide, we wanted three of. We've got six. And the Beastman Bone. We wanted four, so we've had to take them off them. So there we go. Jobs are good. Un. So that's us finished here. Now we are going to go to Gore to do another side quest. But before we do, I've just got this thing. I have to keep doing this. On, um, you can go up there. There's a superior cotton. Have I already got the uh, rawhide? Because I don't see it there. Do I already have it? Ah, 
I don't see it. But we definitely got it, you saw it. Ah, Beastman Rawhide, I've got it there. So why have I not put that? I knew I bloody had it. Right, we're now going to go. Sorry about that. We're now going to go. And in go, we've got a side quest to do. We're going to buy a couple of weapons. And we're also going to do... Remember the mage-like girl who keeps asking us for money? And it keeps... Yes. She's also here. But she only appears after you've done the side quest. If you don't do the side quest, she won't appear. And she will be standing right there. So first of all, we need to buy some weapons. We're going to buy two splitters. No, I don't want to equip it. Then we are going to buy a Grand Axe, which is a Yama Pacific, and hopefully Blockter will ask for this. So now we're going to go talk to Zvido, who's a bit of a schizophrenic, this gentleman here, to kick off another side quest. And I will be honest, I, it is my least favourite side quest because you have to uh, keep avoiding these bloody spiders down the narrow corridors, the narrow path should I say. And also, I keep getting lost. The amount of times I've played this game you'd think I would know my way around, but I do, I keep getting lost. So let's see if I can do this one this time without getting lost. So we've got six treasures, this is the second one. This area, uh, this area of Blackdale has two areas that are three treasures in each. So hopefully I can remember where I need to go and not get lost. The only time I don't get lost in here is when I'm doing a new game plus because I have all the maps. <laughs> Uh, no, I don't think there's anything there. But I do believe it's this one. Yes, we need this. And then... And there's the third treasure. So, we've got the three in this area. So now in the next area, there'll be three. Go away, don't check. Go away, there's nothing to see here. Oh, nearly ran into that one. This is what I say about these frigging spiders. That elite rod, I do believe Pegas will ask for that. That is an upgrade for his weapon he has. So, into the next area. Where there will be another three treasures. And this is generally where I get lost. So, do I go this way? Nothing to see. Have I just gone back on myself? I think I have, am I? Yes. 
told you I get lost. Yeah, because we've just done that. Okay. Uh, it's going there for the fourth treasure. It always, it always throws me off. It shouldn't do, but it does. Right. So we've been down there, so it's this way we need to go. Right, there we go. I hate these frigging spiders. Go away. Nothing to see. Come on out. Okay, later. Boots of remembrance, that's the Jorgen's quest. Finally the map. Right, so now I shouldn't get lost. Famous lost words. Let's have a look. That's where we came from, isn't it? What is it? No, that's where we need to go. Down here. So we need to come. Go away. Nothing to see here. That's the fifth treasure. So one more is right at the end. He's right here. But we want to do some digging as well. So, and there's going to be some flies down here as well, which makes it a bit tricky. But what, so do not pick up the treasure. The minute you pick up the treasure, which is there, you'll be put back to Zvidu. We want to come here. Come on out! Because hmm? what we're looking for here is the Roatian right. steel. Awesome! There. If possible, it would be fantastic if we could get a grand total of 19. Okay, later. But if I don't, I'll just come back at a later date. Hmm? Hmm? All right! Awesome! Hmm? All right! Awesome! Hmm? All right! Awesome! Just got the 19. Now let's just run away from those flies. Thank you. Oh, one stayed there. And there's the sixth treasure. And now we get his schizophrenic friend. He's schizophrenic. He doesn't even remember this. And we get four thousand gold and the Ain Salia. Remember, we need to keep finding these to do another quest. 
So, now we've done that side quest, what we need to do, we need to just come out of Gore. And we need to go back in, because now the mage-like girl will be there. And we can give her the money she wants and for whatever items. And she'll be just stood there, like I said. There she is. Like I said, she only appears after you've done that quest for Zuido. If you don't do that quest, she won't appear here and you won't be able to complete this long quest. And it is worth doing. Because I will, it's not a spoiler, so I will tell you, if you complete all of these, you can actually hire this person here. She is late game, so a lot of people don't hire her because she's such a late game. But she is a very, very good character to hire. And we get the charm of gliding as well. So that's another thing we've done. So let's just have a look here. Relation steel. We want those. I do this so it just reminds me that I don't want to be selling any of these. It's just a little quirk I have. So what are we doing now? Yeah, well, I think we've got that anyway. Yeah, we've got that. Right. I was just checking to make sure what else we needed but i think i've already got it and if i haven't i know where to get it anyway it's back a line i think i've got two let me just check i'm sure i've got the back a line already but We need two of them. So we've got that. So now what we are doing, we're going to go back to Athlam and we're going to do another side quest. Now, again, I will remind you, do not go to the castle. If you go to the castle, it will move the story on and we do not wish to do so at this moment in time. All right, we need to go to the pub. I've already spoken to them. And we're going to do the trade route quest. And we're going to talk to that big fella here. This is a very good quest to do because it opens up another shop where we can buy something and I will be buying something which I equip to rush and I'll show you once we get this done. This is a very simple quest. There's no fighting involved unless you, you want to have some. And basically you've just got to escort this surveyor or trader or whatever through another part of the Gaslin Caves to the Great Sand Sea, avoiding the Yana. Now he, you will be given an option, you'll see anyway. I'll shut up and I'll show you as you as we get through it. So here we go. This opens this area of the Gaslin Caves. And we just have to escort this fella here. Oh, it's a surveyor.
So that's all we have to do. Just have to escort him through this area of Gosling Caves. Now here's your first thing. If you don't want to do any fighting, just do what I do. If I've got a bad feeling about this, it looks there's something up ahead, what should we do? You can go on, I got you covered. We don't want that. Wait, I'll check it out. And he'll keep saying that as we go through the Gaslin Caves. And what you have to do is pick the right answer and you will avoid all fights. Here's the next one coming up. There's a Yana to the right. So you might think, let's head left, but no, no. I made that mistake when I first played the game. No, you head right. Because he's on patrol, so he moves. Who knew that would happen when I first played it? Not me. And now we continue. Like I say, if you want to do some fighting, then you can do. But I'm trying to keep the VR low, so I avoid all enemies wherever possible. Wait, I'll take care of it again. And we have a treasure chest. And as I keep saying, remember to get them. As you come across them, just they are a guild task. And we're coming up again to another one. We are going to head left. Because there's a treasure chest there, and I do believe it's the map for this area. If my memory serves correctly. Yes, the map. So here you have the choice of let's take them on, let's wait and see. If you wait for let's wait and see, you'll have a battle. If you go let's take them on, you'll avoid the battle with a lot of Yana. But again, if you wish to do the battling, feel free. And I believe we just have the one more before the end of this quest. So wait, I'll take care of it. You might think that's what you say because that's what we've been doing. No, this time you go, go on, I got your back. Of course, we knew because we played the game before. Don't, don't worry, I have fought many Yana down here because I've always given the wrong answer when I first played. Another treasure chest.
and we get a load of stuff. So we've got nothing to do here. So we'll just go back to the world map. And because we've done that, as I said before, it does open a shop in Athlon, in the town square. If you don't do that quest, this shop will always be, oh, I'm still setting up, I'm still setting up that type of thing. And we want to talk to this lady here. And what I like to get, you may not, it's entirely up to you, this is, they are expensive, but what I like to get is these. Physical resistance plus three, physical evasion plus three. And they cost 15,000. And what I like to do is, yes I will, I like to give just them. And I buy two of them because I'm an idiot. But I just like, there we go. You can buy more if you like, but they are expensive. So, that's, this becomes available after that quest, as I say. Well, I think that's been a very productive episode. So I think I'm going to end it here. We got the components we needed. Uh, well, let's have a look. What did we do? We got the components we needed. We did some quests. We've opened up a new shop. Uh, so everything's good. So, if you've enjoyed the video, if you found it informative, please hit that like button. It really does help. If you like, leave a comment. Good, bad, or indifferent. I appreciate them all. Any questions about the game? Bang it in the comment section and I will do my very best to answer it for you. Uh, and even consider subscribing to the channel. That way you won't miss a single episode. And until next time, thank you very, very much for watching. It really is appreciated. And I'll see you then.